For the first back to track game for today, we have a matchup between Clear Yellow Star and Grey Color Polka Dot. Well, it has been a long time since Grey Color Polka Dot has been any relevant. When he went 8 1 and 1 in the balance jump back in 2016 17, May he made it to the playoffs as the one seed, but then he got swept in the first round to Quicksand Swirl. Ever since then, he has went 9 21 and 2. So, Grey Color Polka Dot trying to find some life in this year's back to track. But anyway, Clear the Star, he's been pretty relevant over the past few years. He does have a timed race championship to his credit from last year. He made it to this year's balance jump playoffs. But anyway, let's see what happens in this game right now. All right, let's begin this back to track game up. Dice roll. We roll another four. What a lot of those. But anyway, balance jump, timed race, and maze race is the order. All right, first try in this balance jump. Clear the Star will go first on this first try. Greg at the Pokedot will go first in the second try. But anyway, Clear Yellow Star gets zero on his first try. Now it's time for Greg at the Polka Dot. What will he do? And he got something looking like. He got 20 on the first try, so he'll get two points from that. Now it's two to nothing in favor of Greg at the Polka Dot. All right, second try is now underway. Greg at the Polka Dot gets nothing on the second try, and Clear Yellow Star will have a chance to get right back in this one. Let's see what he can do. Down by two points. Clear the star missed it. Didn't even touch it. A zero for Clear the Star on both the first and second tries of that balance jump. And now Greg of the Polka Dot continues to have this two to nothing lead. Clear the star with a 40 on his first try in this timed race. That is not good. Greg of the Polka Dot. Well, have a pretty good chance to get some more points and only gonna get one more looking like. It's a 38. So one point for Greg of the Polka Dot. And now it's three nothing. And Greg of the Polkadot struggling this time to race as he usually does. It's a 41 for him on the second try. Clear of the star. He needs to get his time to race championship days back. It's a 35 for him on the second try. So fairly decent. So he does get three points from that. And now it's all tied up going into this maze race. So whoever can have the better maze race will win this back to track game. Clear of the star with the one to nothing lead. And now we move on to the second point. Clear the star in the red funnel, but he's stuck, and Greg of the Polka Dot's going to go right around him. So great awareness by Greg of the Polka Dot right there, but you cannot do that if you're Clear of the Star. But anyway, Clear of the Star will take the third point, so Clear of the Star is one point away in this maze race from winning this back to track game. And Clear of the Star is in the red funnel on the fourth point, and Clear of the Star wins this back to track game 7 to 3. Well, that was quite a game right there. Now, both of these marbles got a lot to clean up. Now, Clear the Star in that maze race. He looked fairly decent in that maze race. Clear the Star looked like that he was aggressive in that maze race, and he looked like he was having fun. But other than that, Clear the Star has got to clean up the timed race and the balance jump a little bit. Greg of the Polka Dot, on all aspects, he needs to clean up. But it's been a while since Greg of the Polka Dot has been able to do that. And now his record since the Quick Sense World lost... And the quarterfinals of the balance jump is now 9.22 and 2 for Greg of the Polka Dot. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this. I will see you all later for some more games coming up.